In today's video, we're going to take a look at what color socks you can wear with brown trousers. I'm Kirby Allison, and I love helping the well-dressed acquire and care for their wardrobes. Join me as we explore the world of quality, craftsmanship, and tradition. So I've got two great pairs of trousers that I had made recently uh, from Joe Himrajani or Joe and Davidge uh, at davidge.com. Uh, I've got a, a brown linen pair. This is really kind of a chocolate tobacco -y brown. It's not a dark brown, it's not a very light brown. It's a beautiful linen color that in, in my opinion is really perfect for summer. Uh, and then I have a taupe. Now this is a uh, kind of a thick cavalry twill. Uh, this is really more of a fall uh, piece because it's a heavier fabric, uh, but this still is falling within the brown family. And of course you can see all these beautiful trousers are hanging on one of our hanger project felted trouser bar hangers. Uh, all of my trousers are hung on one of our felted trouser bar hangers. For one, they're more efficient with the closet space. You're able to get uh, your trousers in to less space because of how much closer this hangs to the rod. But of course, the most important characteristic of our felted trouser bar is this felted bar where you can see that these trousers uh, just uh, drape over the top of that. They won't actually slide down easily. It does a good job gripping with the friction. But the most important thing is that there's no pressure being applied to the fabric. You don't have to worry about any unsightly creasing that occurs at the locking trouser bar where you pull your trousers off at the beginning of the day uh, and there's a crease mark right across the center thigh. Um, with a felted trouser bar from Kirby Allison, you never have to worry about that. The most important rule whenever it comes to wearing brown is the moment that you introduce brown into your wardrobe, especially with a pair of trousers, everything really needs to be brown. You need to wear brown shoes, you need to wear brown socks, you need to wear a brown belt, uh, and your jacket really needs to have some brown in it to kind of pull and tie all of this together. Now, that said, it's relatively easy to match uh, your socks with uh, brown trousers because, again, going back to that fundamental rule, you really need to stick to brown. So let's take a look at a few of the socks that we have here available as part of our Sovereign Grid collection that really would work beautifully with these trousers. Now first, once you go into the browns, yeah, let's just get it on the table that you're wearing brown shoes. And so all these would be uh, kind of bridging the trouser to the shoe. Uh, and again, this dark brown pair of wool silk socks would go beautifully. Now again, wool silk you might think is reserved for the winter time, uh, but these are so finely knit that really this is a beautiful summer weight um, uh, sock also. But more than anything, you can see that one, we've got two principles working here. One, it's brown, so it works. But second, it's darker, right? And so as a general rule, you want your socks to be a slightly darker than the color of your trousers. Uh, and you can see that this really pairs beautifully. And so browns, again, uh, are really reserved for casual wear. So anytime you put brown on, it's more casual. It opens up the variety of things that you can wear uh, and really have fun with it especially with your shoes, your jacket, your ties. But let's look at another pair of socks that again works beautifully. This is again a pair of brown small dot melange dress socks. Here it's a little bit darker than this wool silk. It has a nice little pattern to it but still works. The final pair uh, is a slightly lighter color. Now this is going to contrast a little bit more uh, but you could totally pull it off with these brown trousers. Now if you want to look at the taupe Again, I think my favorite pair of socks to wear with these taupe trousers would be this kind of brown and tan small dot melange. It's slightly darker, right? So it's going to that first principle of being a little bit darker than your trousers. Uh, and really, it just works beautifully. What I particularly love about this is how the small dot, that color almost coordinates perfectly with this. So it's a nice accent uh, and really is exceptionally elegant. But that said, you could just as easily wear uh, these darker brown socks uh, or uh, even uh, these uh, kind of chocolate brown wool silk socks uh, would work uh, with these trousers. So the truth is, is that once you know the rules, the rest is an art. And so this is where you really kind of have to play around. You have to see kind of what works for your eyes. Uh, what are you comfortable with? I mean, for me, if I was to choose a pair of socks to wear with these light taupe, I mean, the first pair of socks that I would go to would be these light tan and brown small dot melange dress socks. I mean, that works so beautifully. I could almost see myself only wearing those socks with those trousers. And whenever it comes uh, to the linen, again, you know, the linen has some natural texture to it. So maybe I would stay away from the small dot melange because again, it's texture and texture. So maybe I'd pull those aside. 
And honestly, again, I think the socks that I would go to uh, time again uh, would be uh, these beautiful kind of chocolate brown socks, slightly darker than the linen, nice, smooth, no texture. Uh, you could get away with the ribbed uh, brown sock also. That would work very well. Um, you know, these you could say might be slightly too dark. Uh, I've got another pair of brown trousers that these I know work really well with. Uh, but again, you know, the most important thing to remember with brown is once you put brown on your trousers, uh, you really need to, to have your entire palette coordinating with brown. Brown shoes, brown socks, brown belt, uh, and certainly some brown in the jacket itself. So let me know what you think in the comments section below. I'd love to hear how you approach matching your socks uh, to your brown trousers. Uh, this is just really meant to be an overview to kind of answer a quick question. Uh, and so if you have any more questions, feel free to ask them in the comments section below. I really enjoy getting back to as many of those comments as possible. And of course, if you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel, please do by clicking the red box. Uh, click the bell to turn on your notifications so that you can learn whenever we uh, post new videos. And if you don't follow us on Instagram, please do follow me at Kirby Allison. It's probably the uh, best way to stay up to date as to what's going on here. And if you haven't visited KirbyAllison.com, I invite you to do so, where we have the largest collection of luxury garment care, luxury shoe care accessories in the world, as well as other great clothing accessories like these beautiful sovereign grade dress socks. I'm Kirby Allison, and I love to help the well-dressed acquire and care for their wardrobes while exploring the world of quality, craftsmanship, and tradition. Thanks for joining me.